How my heart resonates! I'm pulsing with heat and life! My very blood is a symphony within me! Sunlight Yellow Overdrive! Dio! I know exactly how to deal with you! Dio gave up his life, which showed me just how vulnerable you are! It will be very easy for me now. You won't be able to stop it. All I need to do is fill Bluefoot's Sword of Luck and Pluck with Hamo and slice you with it. Really? The Let's Do Battle stance? You're not serious. No matter how you prepare, human ability is extremely limited and finite. Your Hamon training avails you nothing. It's useless, 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 useless! A mere monkey can never defeat a lion! In comparison to my power, you are but a mere monkey, Jojo! Jojo, let me go! Release me! Think of what we two can achieve! You'd like a taste of eternity, would you not? I can heal your wounds. You and Irina can live together forever! Jojo! Right about now, you're probably wondering who I am. Allow me to elucidate ya. The name is Robert E.O. Speedwagon. I had a hunch Jonathan's run of trouble might not be done, so I followed him back home. I like you, Jonathan, so I'm gonna offer up this little tidbit pro bono. Living in the gutter, you learn to spot lowlights pretty quick if you want to see tomorrow. I've trained my nose to sort out the bad ones from the good just from a sniff. This fella reeks of brimstone and blood worse than anyone I've ever laid eyes on! He is pure evil! Right down to his very bones! Is he a victim of circumstance, you're wondering? Not on your life! He's been evil since he drew his first breath! There is a poetry to this, Jojo. Breathing oxygenates your blood. Your blood carries the oxygen throughout your body. It enriches the cells, giving them the power to keep on living. Those cells combine to form you. Like ripples in the water, your body thrums with the hormone created by proper breathing. All that is left is to use it! Jojo and Speedwagon have told me much. To the mask that allows you to act out your evil heart, I say only this. This time, I break you! Hey, Bambino! It's easy to be cocky when you're up there out of harm's way! Come and fight! These tears that I'm crying are from joy. Joy that I am here with you. Even as a boy, you strove to be a true gentleman. A champion of others, no matter the consequence to yourself. And now that proud and noble Jonathan Joestar is here in my arms. In the warmth of these lips, I feel the cool ebbing of his life. Jonathan Joestar is dying. But we are together. I want to stay like this. Until the ship explodes and everything burns to ash. Until everything is gone. Jojo! Your table manners are simply abhorrent. You act as if you were raised in a barn. Clear Jojo's plate at once. He's had enough. What? That's all the dinner you get tonight. It's clear to me that I failed in your upbringing when I look at Dio. If your mother could see you now. Dio's manners are impeccable. Jojo, don't hate Dio for what he's done. I am to blame for this. I was hard on you because you were a Joestar. I went too easy on Dio, and he might have felt I didn't care. Perhaps he did this for want of a father's love. Please. See that he's buried next to Dario. We're flying! I can't believe it! I bet you're magicians, huh? You'd have to be, right? How did you learn to do all of these neat spells in the first place? Just think of what's gonna happen to Wind Knight's lot if these monsters win. If that Jojo guy gets killed in here, they'll attack us next. What if they hurt Sis? I see. Zeppeli has passed beyond the veil. <gasps> Even if we had arrived earlier, his fate would still have been the same. His death is proof that the strength this Dio wields is devastating. A great many of them are coming. If you wish, I shall handle them for you. Jojo, please no. step aside. 
I have a prior claim. It is my right to avenge my friend's killing. Zeppeli was a brave man and boon companion through two decades of harsh training. Dear, for his life, I shall now send you to the bowels of hell itself! Fell for it, didn't you, fool? Thundercross split attack! We've only just arrived, but he sent that some time ago requesting our aid. He wrote about the stone mask, where it could be found, and especially about the man who wears it. Roses are alive and vital, so Harmon will remain inside them, flowing along with their life force. But the same thing cannot be said for steel. <laughs> well, how the mighty have fallen. This sniveling whelp can't even draw a proper breath now. He'll be causing no more mischief with his Harmon. This is what he gets for crossing you, Lord Dio. Now we are going to play. Or maybe I'll just sit quietly and watch. Well, he suffocates slowly. <laughs> oh, you lads as both as white as a sheet. All the blood is drying from your faces. Maybe I should cut off those useless heads of yours. Now watch it spray out of your necks. <laughs> now you milling corpses to be, prepare for the carnage. You stood there like a statue, ready to take the fatal blow. Oblivion beckoned, but you put your trust in me. Your faith in human goodness is rare. <coughs> <coughs> One side of railed against the pain I feel. Now, going to my rightful end, I cherish all that proves me human. It gives me joy. The embers dull within me, but I am tranquil. There is no bitterness left. What irony to live yet again. Dying with thanks on my lips for the very man who slaughters me anew. I shall return to my one true master. He died like a spineless dog. He was too clever by half. Liked winning his fights with thinking. I just hit them until they fall to pieces. What use have I got for clever? I carry a sword as tall as a man. None of you will get an easy death. <laughs> During a death match, the door to the outside is fashioned to lock tight. Just as I have the key to your collar, you have the one that goes to mine. Therefore, the only way that either of us is going to get out of here... ...is by taking the other's head! You mean to say, you really don't know? <laughs> she's bloody furious! When you get home, she's gonna lock you in the barn and turn your hide! I'm nice. <laughs> this bastard must have died right quick like. Fell off that cliff, I'll warrant. Courage wheels slipped in the mud. They weren't hurting for coin if these fine clothes tell it true. Listen, Dio. I am not long for this world. When I die, <coughs> you get yourself to the Joestar <coughs> mansion along with this letter. The fool thinks he owes me. This is your ticket to greatness. It's your only chance, Dio. Go out there and take this useless world for all you can get! Dario! The lady is dead, but the baby with her. It's still alive, I can hear it. She must have protected it with her body. I know that hurt, but you're still in one piece. Pain's not the worst thing. There's something far worse. It's growing up being too afraid to do anything. What kind of a life would that be? This is the tale of two young men, their destinies bound to intersect, and the stone mask that changes their fates forever. Arena Joestar was soon rescued, afloat near the Canary Islands. And the book of the stone mask was closed, for a time. But that was only the beginning of a new, bizarre adventure.